In today's health news, we are talking about fair food. Nearly a million people head to the North Carolina State Fair every single year. And one thing nearly everyone looks forward to is the food, including myself. But the food isn't always known to be the healthiest, that's for sure. Dr. Kevin Campbell joins me now to talk about how we can actually navigate and make some smarter choices at exactly. the fair. All right, but before we get started, we've got some calorie counts that I don't, I don't know what you're going to do about this, but check these out. Okay. It's, <laughs> it's absolutely amazing how calorie dense these foods are, how that, you know, just a turkey leg, which I always thought was really healthy, 1,200 calories. Can I know. you believe it? We were talking off camera like, are you kidding? We thought it was protein and rich, but corn with butter, 179. Funnel cakes, 452. Mini donuts, over 600. The cheese curds, 759 <laughs> calories. All right, with all that being said, how can we actually enjoy the fair food and not destroy our waistlines. You know, one of the things you have to think about is sampling some things. Right. So one of the hints I always tell people is, you know, make a lap around the food area, make two laps around and figure out what your priorities are. And then when you get some of these foods, don't just get them for you, right. share them with the whole family. These turkey legs and these other things are really large and they can, you know, being shared, you can uh, do a little bit better. Because remember, an adult male needs about 2,500 calories for the whole wow. day. <laughs> <laughs> that turkey leg. That's half your calorie exactly. intake right there. And you also talked about grazing. You know, obviously taking your time. You, you, sometimes we all have a tendency to eat with our eyes. You know, what's the best met methodology to go about that? You know, I think, think about your priorities. What is it at the fair that you really love? It may be the fries. It may be the turkey mm -hmm. leg. And then make that a priority. Come to the fair not starving. Come actually full. Eat something before you go. Drink some water before you go. Stay hydrated. So then if you just take a little bit of everything, I think, you know, you'll limit your calories and you still have the same food fair enjoyment. <laughs> We've got a shot of Stephanie. Stephanie eating. She's <laughs> over there going. She got some calories on uh, Friday when she went. But I think that is the best method to go a little, um, eat a little bit something. I know I try to do that. But Absolutely. It doesn't seem to work though, Doc. I just continue to eat there. But some great tips there. Dr. Thank Kevin you so Campbell, much. always a, great to have you in. If you want more tips on how to stay healthy at the fair and enjoy the fair, just head over to our website right now and hit up the State Fair section on WNCN Today. Steph